Hi everybody, this is Gary Dean with Sentiment Timing and this is our free video report for Wednesday, January 11th, 2017. So let's get started. I hope your uh, trades have all been going uh, in the direction that you wanted. And uh, one of the things that we've been kind of just stressing, uh, especially from a technical view and, and even from a topping pattern, uh, we believe that things are going to start getting really, really choppy. And if you're looking for a swing trade that you, you know, you just really wanted to stay out of these markets right now. And we are not overly bullish and we weren't overly bearish on the markets. We were kind of neutral. And, and we really, the way that uh, it's been described is that we just, you know, it's going to be get really sloppy. And, and that's pretty much what's been going on. And anybody that's been uh, waiting for a big swing trade has been, uh, you know, getting, they're jumping in on a breakout and watching things reverse back down. And then when they're jumping in on uh, on a bearish trade or a short trade, they're seeing to take out support and then, and then shoot right back up again. So it's been pretty sloppy. And if you're day trading, it's actually, uh, you know, really good day trading tape right now. But we're, we're more interested in, in the swing trades. That That's what we look for. We look for the downside as well as the upside. We are not just a bearish uh, website here. But the thing is, is that when it heads up and, it, and it, you know, we're doing stuff like this, it just gets boring. So the excitement does seem to come when we go down because, the you know, you can you can make two, three hundred points on the s p in a matter of a month you know just from this i mean that's that's more than people make in a year sometimes two years on it but when you do that two three times a year then now you can see why you know what he's predicted over 1400 points uh and also why some of the largest uh financial institutions in the world uh pay him tens of thousands of money uh tens of thousands of dollars for uh his information so just do a quick recap on the 17th um woody was saying that we should see uh a uh a, an uptrend going into the first quarter of 2017 so going all the way back from uh november 17th you pretty much knew not to be looking for any kind of swing short trade because we we're going to be heading up into into the first quarter of 2017 and something else he has said is what's the best way to set up a 20 or 30 percent market decline and that's maybe get the s p to 2300 or 2350 so we came within 18 points of 2300 and if you go back and see where the s p was on november 17th you can see that it was a pretty nice you know overall trade so what was supporting the lows on that was that this is an, an intermediate term sentiment and you can see that we we made it pretty low this is the trump bottom uh we had two bottoms here and this is the black hole and we've had huge rallies so that is pretty much uh you know just a recap of it and when you get into the euphoria phase things like i said things get boring everybody thinks not, nothing the market's never going to go down and and that's when your professionals are, are building short positions and when everybody's panicking they're building uh long positions and that's pretty much what we you know try to accomplish here at sentiment timing is just keeping you on the right side of the uh, the cycle and, and what's going on. So this is from uh, today's report. And uh, it, what uh, Woody was saying, we, we were looking for this, uh, the trend to continue into, and unfortunately I cannot give you those dates. They're for paid members, but um, this is really what you need to pay attention to because – um, remember what he had said on on the 17th, and that was uh, you know a 20 or 30 percent correction. Well, he's looking for several of them uh, up and down moves this year. So things are going to get really, really volatile. And remember, where do you make your money? You make tons of money on these types of moves. When it's like this, it's crap and it's really hard to trade if you, you might be able to get into one of these and yeah it's a nice little move but when it's this kind of chop it's nothing it, but when you get into these moves like this this is where you make the money and and 2017 is going to be that way and and what what he had, had compared it to was just the way um you know trump is uh, is going to be as a president you know it's erratic uh exciting and, and that's what the market's going to be. We've had eight years of pretty much boring market, and now things are going to change. And if you're not, uh, you know, able to know when these turns are coming, you're going to get blindsided. And, and for a lot of people, they're going to get their portfolios just wiped out because they're going to be uh, jumping in to these rallies at the tops, and they're going to be 
selling at the bottoms. And, you know, the, the, the good part about knowing in advance when to expect these moves is you're able to control your emotions. And that's a huge part of uh, of trading and making money in this market is is controlling your emotions and, you know, knowing what to expect and then having that backed up by sentiment, then backed up by regular technical analysis. You know, you, you build a really, really good picture, and that's what we were talking about in the roundtable from last week. So, anyway, um, we have reversal dates that are going to be coming, and we are expecting several down, up, down trends this year, and most likely they are going to be in this 20 30%. Now, we have not even seen – I mean, we saw 120% uh, at, I think, retracement last year, and, and people were calling a new bear market. Well, imagine going down 20% and having all the bears jump on, only to see us jump up 30%, and all the bear, all the bulls thinking that we're going to the moon, and then we drop another 20. This is the type of uh, frustration that's going to be out there this year. So sentiment. Uh, one thing that Woody said he's been looking for is he's going, he's expecting a series of very high sentiment numbers, and that's going to have everybody chasing this top. Once they are in and we are approaching our reversal date that our members know, um, that's when they're going to pull the rug out and everybody is going to get caught on the wrong side of the tape. It's just the way it happens uh, really every single, every single turn that we have. So down here, everybody was bearish. Everybody was wrong. Up here, everybody was bullish, but you saw we had a divergence going. So tops are different than bottoms. Bottoms, we get spike lows, and that's the same with sentiment. Tops, what happens is we get divergences, and when we get the divergences, it's given us a clue that we have some type of reversal coming. But again, what we do is back them up with technicals. So one of the things that I've been saying, I've just been giving out uh, you know, just uh, reaction lines because – if a certain level was taken out, expected to go to the next one, and these were just really, really short-term trades. But technicals, what I was uh, bring, talking about is this is a 15-minute chart. We have bearish divergences. It, it, I, you know, we got down to support level. This was our reaction line was right at the 20, uh, 2271, and it made it right down to the 2260. Again, not really the type of trade that uh, we're, we're doing in sentiment timing, but. If people are looking to just make some quick trades on their own, you know, I'm giving these numbers out, you know, so they can do that. But uh, once the, you know, once this support was taken out, yes, you saw a lot of bulls get washed out only to see it get, uh, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> uh, we see a spike right back up again. And anybody that was short is getting stopped out right now. So. My take, there's a good shot. You're going to see the S&P at 2300 before everything is said and done. Um, does it make it safe to buy? You can do it. You just have to, like I said, have your, you know, be close to your computer and put your stops in place. Because we have bearish divergences on the 15-minute charts. We have bearish divergences on the 60-minute charts. And if we look at it daily, we have bearish divergences there. So every top that we've had, it's been the same type of format. Now what happens is we, you know, we want to just kind of wait for uh, when the, you know, when what he's going to be expecting the top, and and we know those dates, and then we start matching up where things uh, may be reversing. But like I said, there's, uh, it's going to be an exciting year, and you don't have to be, you don't have to be in this market all the time. And, and as a matter of fact, if you're just in it four times and you catch the you know, a 20% top, uh, you know, that drops 20% and then you catch the low and it runs up 20. You know, you're, you're talking you can make more points in, in one year than some people have made in the last seven years. And and this is really what we look for. And we're pretty excited that uh, we're going to be seeing some some big volatility come through. We're keeping the same coupon code at 217, uh, at, at, at 20, uh, 2017. Um, it's going to be something we're just doing. The first two months are going to be uh, are, are going to be ninety nine dollars, and it's going to move to that. We're not really going to keep doing specials. It's going to be this this for you know if you want to join, this is it. Um, now anybody that does join, what you have to know, I'm giving you guys a free membership to uh, to my Markets Path. I do not do video reports similar to this. I do morning notes, give you an idea of what I'm uh, going to do. Uh, my trade alerts, and we also have a trade room. 
I typically charge seventy nine ninety nine for this, so it's a $960 value that you get for free as long as you are uh, – a member of Sentiment Timing. So, like I said, we have some turn dates approaching. Uh, 2017 is going to be exciting. We are pretty excited about it. And uh, you really want to know when to expect a reversal because it's coming soon. And uh, if you're positioned right, it's going to be a fantastic trade. But also positioning yourself right when we're about to hit a bottom is uh, even more lucrative. So with that, until next week, have a great night.